My name is Stephanie Goldfarb. I am from the north of England and I moved to Canada two years ago. I've decided to go back to school because I'm trying to emigrate here so I needed to get up points for school and Sportshaw seemed like a great idea. The class I've chosen is Community Supports Worker with Social Services because it's what I actually do now. I've been a behaviourist and nanny and teacher for the last four years. The programme has a lot of overlap with what I already do in my professional life and I wanted to learn more of the theory behind my practical experience that I've already got so far in my life. I've heard of Sprotshaw on the radio, I've seen it around different campuses when I've travelled around BC and I always wondered what it meant when they said they have been going for so long. It really inspired me when I heard on the radio and it's 1903. <laughs> like I always thought this must be a really good school if they've been going for that long. My initial process from starting from scratch of deciding to go to school to actually being in a school was first looking online. I started looking at all the comparison between the schools that are private and then the, the government schools and when I just did a Google search of diplomas to do in Canada. Sprotshaw was one of the top ones that came up. There was lots of other schools that are in the list as well. And I did actually inquire to all of them because I, want, I didn't know how it worked in Canada with going to school. So I really needed the advisor's help to help me with all of that. And Sprotshaw with the international department, as soon as I wrote that I was an international student, I had a really good communication with the, with the international department there. And I then I decided, Okay, Sprotshaw was the way to go because they started making it really easy for me and really saying, okay, this is what we need now, now we need this and they really worked alongside with me um, for as long as I needed and as much contact as I needed. The campus in Kelowna, after I'd already been transferred here, Andy in the international department handled all of my transfer once I realised that the Kelowna campus also offered the same subject that I wanted to study from living in Abbotsford. I then came to the campus to do all my signing, pick up the first couple of books, and everyone was so nice. It was so nice as well to talk to people on the phone or by email and then actually meet them in person. And it was a, a really small, homely environment when I walked in and they gave me everything I needed and I was then ready to start class. And it was wonderful actually as well meeting the uh, induction lecturer who did our first week with us. She was actually in the office at the time so I went to go and meet her as well because at that point I was still in Abbotsford and I was transitioning to Kelowna and it was nice to actually say okay now I'm here in Kelowna these are now the people that I'm working with and everyone was super nice. I've only been in Kelowna for th three weeks so far yeah, we're yeah. on our third week of class and it's going really well I really like it I'm so glad because it's been a while since I've been in school. The last school I did, well, not a while, but 2016 to 2017, I did a diploma in England. And it was a very, very different setting. It was very stressful. We had to know what we're doing. Whereas the first three weeks already, it's so obvious where we need to be, what we need to do, and where we will go after that step and that has took a lot of stress away from me and that's what I really like. Yeah. <laughs> Any advice I would give to a future student looking to study at Sprotshaw would be absolutely go for it. It is seems stressful and a bit hard at the beginning but it's not. They know what they're doing, they know how to help you and they will help you every step of the way.